pasado. Yoshi. Pokémon Trainer. Why is this one so much louder than all the other setups? Because it's Station 1. The set going to Zooey. Oh yeah, good job, Zooey. Where is the... Ah, here. So now we have Wex in Devon 3000. Yoshi in Pokemon Terrain. I imagine this matchup is uh, quite annoying for PT. To say nothing of Yoshi just being generally annoying. Up here? Mm, okay, no, it wasn't close enough. Why did that kill Charizard? Why? Why does Charizard... Or why does Yoshi allow to have killing aerials like that? Someone tell me. Can you spare some of that my way? Please and thank you. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't just fade back to ledge, not against Yoshi. Okay, let's try that forger miss. Okay, not quite getting that. Jab lock? No, not quite. So much damage! Are we getting a stock on the board? Oh, no. Yeah. Damn. That was uh, two three stocks in the span of... Yoshi wins. I don't know, it looked like they were scrapping for a second. I'm not sure. Game two, staying on FD. I suppose not a terrible choice for evil character. I will say at the very least, Devin will have an issue as Squirtle against Yoshi, since he wants to do combos involving many individual hits. And if he messes up that combo, Yoshi's out of there. I was about to say, that just assumes Yoshi doesn't just flutter through and get killed anyway. Case in point. Like I always say, there's no reason not to do the scrub jump as Yoshi. I mean, at this point, you probably... Bye. Oh, Devin, not like this. I can't remember the last time I heard Squirtle Star KO. Um, yeah, fast fallers do tend to not die off the top as much. It also just Squirtle. Most players at this point would have chosen to the Leaf Frog we have on stage right now. It took a lot of people, including me, a very long time to clock in that the Bulbasaur line are all sort of froggy. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Let's Go, of all things. What did Let's Go do? Because the, um... Those games have, like, the... You know the Heart Gold Soul Silver, like, travel, like, partner feel mechanic? Yes. Oh, So Let's Go has that, and it's fully... Like, it's 3D animated, because they have the technology for it. And all the, Bul all the Bulbasaur line hop like frogs. Yeah, but they've always been doing that. Not in 3D, they haven't. 
Especially not in especially not in uh, Gen 4. Not. Um they were they were all sprites. They just wiggled. They did their little idle animation and moved with you. Okay, so how do I put this? Whatever. You know I'm right. Okay, but <laughs> Ivysaur was running like that in Brawl, so there you go. Yeah, that's true. And I'm sure the Pokemon company gave some input on that. But also, I'm pretty sure Pokemon had their run animations established since X and Y because they... Ooh! Nice, Devin. They're Down able to goes. run onto the screen at, uh, in Pokemon and me. Uh, I, I think. Yeah. I think. Do they? I don't remember. I feel like they just spawned in. You tap them because they're facing... Their back is facing you, and then they like, Oh, hi. All right, you know what? I'm sure this was well established at some point anyway. That's a Gen 1 Pokemon we're talking about. Mm. Up air. Meanwhile, we have to ponder the biology of Yoshi's. Are they all born with Tim's right out of the egg? Um, I'm pretty sure they are. I'm gonna check the baby Yoshi sprite. Oh, I'm pretty sure they have shoes right out the gate. Yeah. Damn, damn, imagine knowing your shoe size from birth. Baby Yoshis are born with Tims. Well, they get bigger when they grow up, so the, the Tims are clearly part of their biology. Are we getting a game three? So we may ponder more biology of these creatures. Okay, good. Good thing you switched. Press, seven, just player, press player blitz. Press it again, honestly. Do it. Sure, just press why it. not? Ugh. No one expects it. Def, please. Fl Flare Def, Blitz no. into the stage from him recovering low. What's the worst that could Just happen? Just click it, Devin! Ah! Oh, he could have did a beefy there for the hit. Oh, well. Oh, I think Wex is looking for up smash. Maybe. Oh. I mean, Yoshi is no... Again, I have to ask, why does that kill at all? Devin going for a weird down here. It looks like a down air I would do, but... Just, oh no, oh no, no, oh he's still alive! It's stale! Yeah, yeah, just uh, do yeah, it. That's correct. Everything's gonna kill you at this point, you might as well just take the damage from Flare Blitz. Oh. Oh! Ah! That was definitely a shield grab attempt. I felt it in my soul. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, hold your shield. What can Yoshi do about it? Oh my god. Devin. Devin, you're such an asshole, Devin. Good job, Devin. How is he an asshole for doing the objectively right thing? Also, where are all the matches, man? Actually, <laughs> not to not to randomly interrupt it. I'm just pondering between Minmin and Terry, who let the other go to FD. I mean, maybe they they clearly just both find the stage agreeable. They do, but not against the other character, I'd imagine. In any event. I don't think that works. Okay, never mind that. Uh, He's fine. He's not fine. Could he not have just air dodge straight up and grab the ledge? He wouldn't have been. He did. Do, he did go straight up. Oh, he just pushed him in there. Oh, damn. That's unfortunate for Wex. Devin yeah. is loving that. Yeah, Devin's in the lead, oh. so he can just switch to Charizard and proceed to do big body things and get away with it. Honestly. Case in point. 
Like, that's one of the messed up things about Pokemon Trainer. Or, with Smash in general, like, if you go down a stock and you're fighting a big body, it sucks because they're going to start swinging all this nonsense at you. And if you get hit by any of it, you probably die again. Yeah, I feel, oh God. But Pokemon Trainer gets the privilege of deciding to do this mm -hmm. after getting a stock lead using Squirtle or Ivysaur. It's like, oh, I'm in the lead? Charizard, go get him. I'm pretty sure Pyramitha has the same, like, ideology. Except Pyra is almost exclusively doing the killing anyway. Kind of, sort of, but honestly, she, Pyra, she, Pyra she, kind of sucks. She hits like a big body is what I'll say. She does, but I I don't find her as scary as the other big bodies. Well, like, the immediate threat isn't there, but she gets away with so much. I know. I think the biggest thing is just that you're allowed to shield against Pyra compared to so many other big bodies. Goodbye. Like, if I'm fighting Charizard, I can't shield safely because he's going to grab me and throw me all over the place. That's me. I'm spinning into that. That is a big body. Well, l lucky you, Sonic the Hedgehog. Most characters don't... That's not to say Charizard still isn't, like, top 15 fastest in the entire game for some reason. It is quite odd. They're, like, I'm pretty sure at least five of the top 15 fastest characters in this game are all in triple-digit weight classes. Something like that. Up smash. Because you have Charizard, Ridley, Banjo-Kazooie, Bowser, and someone else I'm forgetting. Yeah, just Flare Blitz. Actually, technically Cloud, too. Sea Loud. Yeah, just barely done triple digits. Back air? Devin's going to be patient about it. Hell, Falcon hey. too. I'm pretty sure Falcon's triple. No. He's not? Yes. Falcon's triple dip? What the fuck? I'm about to say he better be. Charizard is Falcon. Anyway. <laughs> Wrong victory theme, boyo.